then why do I only talk about XRP? Is one of the things I get asked on YouTube a lot. There are a lot of great cryptocurrencies out there, some with even more technical promise than XRP. However, I am sure that XRP will be the one that makes this industry popular and completely changes our financial system in the future. People, in this video, I'm going to talk about XRP's basic investing theory and why I think it will do best in the future when we're moving talk about XRP's investing theory and why I think it will do best in the future when we're moving toward. Um, I think everyone should watch the whole movie, so guys, make sure you stay that long. I get a lot of questions about XRP, so I thought I'd use this chance to quickly talk about what makes it different from other coins. Why are you only getting XRP? What's wrong with XLMM? Do not use Stronghold. Why not? I'm not interested in any of these coins, and I'd like to start with the idea of high-level investment. Hey, everyone, I became interested in cryptocurrencies because I thought they could change the way money is handled. This problem has not been fixed by any other technique. Not only do we have centralized businesses that do great work, but we also have centralized companies that do work that many of the other cryptocurrency projects do. Also, I'm not sure if many of these coin projects need tokens at all. One thing is clear, though, if you want to move money from point A to point B, you need liquidity and a token. The fact that this can happen independently is great. XRP solves a big problem in our banking system in a good way. Achieving the main goal of cryptocurrencies allow the quick flow of value between places at the speed of the Internet. Guys, the technology we use for our banking system is very old. Money can't be moved quickly or easily from point A to point B with the way things are now. Ripple is also stopping this flow of value, which I think is a very important way to use coins. Just like I said before, there are many ways to build a coin project and many possible users to think about. Moving money from point A to point B, on the other hand, seems like the most natural, obvious and obvious use case for coins. Guys, it looks like a few different groups are trying to work on the main idea. Am I right? You have XLM, you have things that are like Stronghold. A lot of different projects are trying to make it easier for money to move from A to B. So why do I worry about XRP? XRP is one of the biggest cryptocurrencies. A lot of people will say, oh, the big ones don't move as much. What I'd like to enter is a micro ticket. Guys, shaking up the banking sector isn't easy. It takes people and billions and billions of dollars to get into the most important talks. Rio's Rosie is at Ripple. Ripple has people who used to be in BlackRock. Amazon, Uber, and Bank of America are just a few of the biggest banks in the world that have teamed up with Ripple. American Express and Bank of America are also partners. Ripple needs to have these footholds in order to really cause this chaos. There are, in fact, other cryptocurrencies with more advanced technologies, but their records aren't as long as the ones for XRP. Um, they don't have the connections that Ripple does with the big names in the banking world. A lot of people thought there would be a community movement when Bitcoin first came out. An awful lot of these new ideas were going to come from the retail sector and take over the current system. A lot of people thought that big banks would use the financial tools that small businesses created. While stores themselves would build new ones, people, this is not how I think things will go. From my point of view, the big companies will continue to be in charge. The big companies that own all the assets and value will still be the most important players in the financial system of the future. The only thing that comes to mind is that they'll make the rails better. I think they will get better at how they deal with money, move money, and hold value. So folks, I'm looking for a company that can help these big businesses adopt the technologies that I think will be necessary and important. That has always been how Ripple has worked. Ripple hasn't tried to get involved in this kind of grassroots organizing. Retailers built Ripple, but the company hasn't tried to force institutions to use it. The biggest central banks, countries and businesses are getting a direct message from Ripple. Hey, this is a technology we made for you and we want you to accept it. Hey guys, I really think this is the best way to win. Guys, I'm telling you, these strong institutions that Ripple is connected to are what make the network effects happen. There are thousands of banks below these major banks that are linked to them. However, if a central bank adopts a technology, it can force other institutions that back it to change too. This is the process that makes network effects very strong. On top of that, agencies move very slowly. That's why if they do decide to switch networks, they won't do it right away unless they have to. Because of this, XRP's past success is very important. Since the beginning, XRP has shown that it is trustworthy, stable, and error-free. These institutions will need to be able to keep using the XRP database as their system. Ladies and gentlemen, what we're seeing here are the first steps of a new technology taking over a whole new business. Uber made it hard for people to use public transportation. Because of it, you can now use your phone to get around. It got in the way of talking, texting, and iPhone messaging. We can share our lives on Facebook and Instagram these days, and we can move pictures and data around easily. Despite this, the Internet hasn't quite caught up to the core of our banking system yet. Yes, there are a few small APIs that we can connect to that will let us send money to each other. Large companies, on the other hand, continue to take on a lot of counterparty risk. Besides cryptocurrencies, there is currently no other way to send money from one place to another. Because of this, uh, 
He said that Ripple's dominance in the cryptocurrency system will be very good for XRP. Hey everyone, I don't think that many coin startups are working with big companies to help them use blockchain technology like Ripple did. In the end, these groups do nothing but spend money. They buy property, they own property, and it's clear that these institutions will make big steps forward in the cryptocurrency area, putting trillions of dollars worth of client and personal wealth into these assets. I really hope this helps you understand why I'm so excited about XRP and Ripple. It's not always about the technology. It's what people have been working on for the last 10 to 15 years. Guys, it's not going to be easy to mess up the banking system. It will take some time. Ripple has also been working on it for a very long time. I don't think any other coin project will be able to really catch up to and support what Ripple has shown. It's hard for me to put a lot of time and effort into these projects because I don't think they can ever compare to what XRP and Ripple could do for this future system. Right now, the biggest companies in the world are trying to invest in this type of product and make it essential to the financial system. Ladies and gentlemen, these businesses have only ever been linked to one company, and I think that company, Ripple, will make XRP the most important coin technology that will control the flow of money in the future. Guys, I really hope this movie helps you understand why XRP and Ripple are so important to me, even though there are many bets to choose from. I don't think any of them are as well placed as the wildlife on this channel. Guys, I've never been more sure of what we're building here. It will be amazing to see how things turn out in the future. XRP and Ripple seem to be getting closer and closer to being in charge of the futures money system every day. Anyway, thanks for coming. I hope you liked this update. If you liked it, please remember to subscribe and like it again. It's really important.